I think those two bodyguards are trying to find us, but um, we're not going to let them find us. So we'll go do another mission. Hmm. Let's go see what Tarvin's up to. Hunting partners. Fast travel. <clears throat> Let's go! Oh yeah, I let those guys go, so I guess they escaped. Whatever. Um, no, wrong button. And... That. I think we got a... Um, upgrade? No? Ah, oh, we've got Mithril. Max health up. Increases your health by 20. Increases your maximum health shot by 2. Focus up. Another sword rune. I think we'll get health and... Health shot. Yeah, why not? I've got 100 left, so that's not much. Um, we're nearly at the next ability point. So that'll be good. Right. Let's go see what Torvin's up to. Torvin has more to teach you about hunting beasts before you face the great white grog. Off by my wee scars. Oh, not at all. I actually have a few of my own. <laughs> oh, I'll bet. What type of battle scars did you get from the Black Gate, eh? Splinters! <laughs> oh, or did you uh, scar your voice telling your soldiers to head into battle? Tread lightly. My scars run very deep. Huh. The mighty Grog. He gave me these. And he also took my hunting partner. So, what now? Well, another lesson for you, my captain. <clears throat> Maybe you'll even come out of this one on Scar. <laughs> So, what backward lesson do you have planned this time, eh? Shooting Krabain to prepare us for the mighty Grog? You want to hunt Grog? Then so you shall. But not just any Grog. This is a rare one. It's territorial. Strong enough to claim land as its own. And you and me, we're trespassing. Tell me, Captain, you ever slay a Grog before? Today will be the first of many. Now you're talking like a hunter. I've got a feeling in my gut you may survive this, Captain. Well, since that's the largest part of you, I like those odds. So I assume you have a plan to kill this Grog? I do, Captain. And since you're so good at taking orders, I'll tell you how, step by step. Step one, when he's crunching on an Uruk, sneak up behind the giant beast and bleed the bastard's ankle. But why not his throat? There is one place Graugs aren't covered in spiky scales. They don't call a weakness a Graugs heel for nothing. You want me to sidle up to this beast? If you can manage it without being crushed, yes. Hmm. It's a big monster. There it goes. What a fine, fine specimen. And it'll meet a fine end. Sneak up behind the Graug and press... And just bleed it, yeah. Well, he's facing this way. I've got to pierce its ankle if I want to bleed it. Now we run, run away. Before she jumps on you, your speed will now match the ground. Scouts to chase you. I'll be waiting. 
That will be quite a ride. Where the fuck are the Karagoras? It's Karagor there. I need a Karagor for speed. Whoa. Easy enough. Right, right. Um. Hear you? I've slain bigger crowds when I was a wee boy, and my beard was only three inches long. <laughs> Better shot than this. My God. Okay. <laughs> I think I was locked in focus. Shoot it a few times. That makes sense. What's step four? There is no step four. It should be dead. You must have done it wrong. I'm following your orders. Well, that's your problem. Think for yourself. Quick time events I suck at. and attacks to enemies in the area. You can also grab neat orcs to regain health.
We're riding a fucking Groat, man. I'm gonna eat you. Being the last one alive. Your life ends with the sting of my blade. Hmm. I say, it's a wee bit unusual to ride a ground. Nothing like a little improvising, eh? <laughs> All right, Captain. That's it. You should instinct, gumption, respect. <laughs> Training's over. Got guts? Let's go spill some, eh? The darkness of Mordor doesn't seem to touch that dwarf. The Seven Rings of Power did not turn the Dwarf Kings to wraith. As the Nine Rings did to man. They are a stubborn as stone and cannot be dominated by evil. That is why Sauron has sworn to destroy them. Hmm. Well, it's unlocking ability, eh? Shoulder charge, um, combat drain. Throwing daggers. I never, never use this. <laughs> Critical strike, double history gained on well timed attacks. Well, why not? Blade Master. Yeah, we'll just take it, why not? There's no reason not to. Got more me through. Sword rune slot, bow rune slot, dagger rune slot. Okay, what are our runes? Uh, weapons and runes. Do we have a good one? This. 67% focus for grab shank kills, 46. Recover 52 focus on a style kill. Uh, it's all focus stuff. Let's see what our bow runes are. 26% chance to recover two well shot and any kill while riding a monster. 30% chance for plus 30 focus on a headshot kill. Plus 10 health on a headshot kill. 25% focus on any shadow strike move. So far, the health thing is winning. But we already have that. That's our sword gut. <coughs> Pre plus 3 health shot and a flurry kill. Recover full focus when a hit streak becomes charged. 85% focus on ground execution. Recover 55% focus on ground execution. 11% I think we'll take that. The full focus when hit streak becomes charged. We'll um, get our sword rune updated. I love that little carving animation. It's awesome. And we'll take the terrors one. Plus three ups and shot and a very kill. History become charged. Full focus. Not bad. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Let's see where, where we can go. Um, this is probably closer. Probably. Let's go kill the great white Grog. See how long that takes me. Because I remember it taking quite a long while. But we'll see. It should be doable at least. No Next one I see, I'm gonna learn to ride it. You should be afraid of them. Just one. <laughs> Time to rip you up. Ah, you bastard.
We're landing crits. That's good. Well. Time to go see what... Torben. The way Grog's like. Wait, wait, I pressed A. I definitely did. I assume you know the path. The real question is, are you ready to travel it? I hope so. Whatever happens during the hunt, think what would Torben do? Actually, that's a good life lesson for you to follow always. I pray your training sticks, or else you'll stick to the wall once the mighty Grog hurls you there. I'm ready to fight the Grog. And that's just what you do. Fight! No art, no finesse! The hunt isn't about swinging and slashing, it's bigger than that! From your perspective, Dwarf, everything is bigger. Yes, this Grog is very, very big! Oh, oh wait, you're mocking me. Graugs are one of the oldest species of Mordor, and the deadliest by far. It's been a long time since I faced this Graug. Let us hope time wasn't as gentle to him as it was to me. My old partner and I once tracked a Graug from Mount Dolmed to Nogrod. We finally slayed it and got stuck under his leg for two days. Ah, those were fun times. Last time I saw the beast was when my old partner and I tracked it into his dwelling. How did you get out alive? Luck. The Grog knocked me senseless. When I came to, it had ended my partner. Facing that creature alone was a death sentence. I'd been hunting this Grog for almost a decade. That's a lot of years of dedication to one beast. Dedication? Or a sign you preach better than you hunt. Oh, that's funny, Captain. I'll be sure to laugh when the beast eats you alive. The mighty Grau will be my legacy. Dwarves will tell tales of Torvan the Hunter for generations. And I'll have them throw your name in there somewhere. <laughs> Cargoers are too quiet. I don't think the Grog is home. <laughs> then we go in and we wait. An ambush? How military. I like it. Next. That's just as sharp as a day our father made it. That's right! Remember me! 
Christ. That's a big fucking grog. Yeah, the ghouls, they um, give them health. So, if you kill those... wasn't very close. We got no focus, so this is going to be difficult. Kill him! Maybe one more, if we can kill enough ghouls. Two for one, that was nice. That was a good shot, I love that bet. That was also a lucky shot. Poison me, you bastard. Let's do this. Damn it, there's more goons. Come on, bitch. Damn it! One more time. Thank you. 
Nee, dat. Bad girl. Stop it. Oh, what? He killed me, the bastard. Do we have to do the whole thing again? Oh my god. Mother of it's God. Too strong. I must attack from afar. A shot to the skull will disorient him. This is annoying. Man, run at me. We're gonna do this. There's no way we won't. Maybe we can get him this time. Run away! Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Boom! He's dead. <laughs> ah, 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 well, that's what I call beast hunting, eh? Indeed, indeed. Next time I'm not going to let you have all the fun. Oh, no, no. This is the last time. 
I have other prey to pursue. Well, you need help on your journey, so what do you say? We put no, some no, shadows. No, 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 I have to do this on my own. <sighs> if you survive, <clears throat> come to the Blue Mountains, eh? <laughs> Lots of friends that will drink until their kegs run dry. I see how much a dwarf can drink. <laughs> <laughs> I do hope our paths cross again. Right. Now, how do I get you out of here? <laughs> Boom. Killed the great white rogue, motherfucker. We cannot return to Gondor, you would've. A nobleman never forgets a debt. There are other places in Middle Earth we can go. Perhaps Rohan. We could go north. Eskorov. Use a different name and start anew. I would love that in my heart. Okay. That was a long episode, I think. Maybe 30, 35 minutes. But yeah. It's a good place to end. Get into an episode. I hope that Torvin finds his way home now that his hunt is over. If he does, then he will find his home is not as he left it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.